state your name and profession before putting forward your question. May we have the first question from the lady side, please. Assalamu alaikum. I am Sabah Bakai from Delhi. And my question to Zakir uncle is, the Christian concept of the God is a trinity, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. But these three are one. Does this mean that they believe in only one God? The sister asked the question that the Christians believe in Trinity, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, and that they are one. Does it mean that they also believe in one God? Sister, if you analyze the word Trinity, it occurs nowhere in the Bible. If you search the full Bible, the word Trinity doesn't exist anywhere in the Bible. It's not there in the Bible. But the word Trinity is there in the Holy Quran. But the word Trinity is there in the Holy Quran. The Holy Quran says in Surah Nisa, chapter 4, verse number 171, it says, Don't say Trinity. This says, stop it, it's better for you. For God is one God. It's again repeated in Surah Maida, chapter number 5, verse number 73. It says, لَقَدْ قَفْرَ الَّذِينَ قَالُوا إِنَّ اللَّهَ سَالِسُ سَلَاسَ They blaspheme those who say that Allah is one of three in a trinity. For there is no God but Allah. So the word trinity is not mentioned in the Bible, but it is there in the Quran. And Quran says, وَلَا تَقُولُوا سَلَاسَ Don't say trinity. The closest verse that you can find in the Bible, which can be taken for Trinity, is the first epistle of John, chapter number 5, verse number 7, which says, For there are three that bear record in heaven, the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost. And these three are one. This verse of the Bible, first epistle of John, chapter 5, Verse number 7 is the closest resemblance to Trinity in the full Bible. But if you read the Revised Standard Version, which has been revised by 32 scholars of the highest eminence, backed by 50 different Christian cooperating denominations, they have removed this verse from the Bible as an interpolation, as a concoction, as a fabrication. It was not removed by Muslims or non-Christian scholars, but it was removed by 32 Christian scholars of the highest eminence, backed by 50 different corporate denominations as an interpolation, as a concoction, as a fabrication, because it was not there in the original manuscript. We Muslims, we should thank the galaxies of deities, the doctors of divinity for getting the Bible one step closer to the Quran, closer to Islam. As the Quran says, Wala taqulu salasa, don't say trinity. In fact, if you analyze, as I said in my talk, Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, never spoke about trinity. That Father, Son and Holy Ghost, they were one. In fact, he said, in the Gospel of John, Chapter 14, verse number 28, My father is greater than I. Gospel of John, chapter number 10, verse number 29, My father is greater than all. Gospel of Matthew, chapter number 12, verse number 28, I cast out devil with the spirit of God. Gospel of Luke, chapter number 11, verse number 20, With the finger of God I cast out devil. Gospel of John, chapter number 5, verse number 30, I can of my own self do nothing. As I hear, I judge. And my judgment is just. Because I seek not my will, but the will of thy father who has sent me. He never spoke about Trinity. In fact, when he was asked that which is the first of the commandments, he said, it's mentioned in the Gospel of Mark, chapter number 12, verse number 29. Shama Israelo Adnai Lahaino Adnai Khad. Which means, your O Israel, the Lord, our God, is one Lord. But if you ask the Christian church, in the catechism, they tell you that the Father is a person, the Son is a person, and the Holy Ghost is a person. 
but they aren't three persons, they are one person. Person, 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 but not three person, one person. What language is this? One plus one plus one is equal to three. It's not equal to one. One into three is three, not one. So when we ask them that suppose there are three triplets, identical triplets, if one of them commits murder, can you hang the other? They say no. Then you ask them why? Because each one has a different personality. If one of the triplets commit murder, you can't hang the other because each one has a different personality. And when the Christian, when they think about the Father in heaven, they think like an old man like Santa Claus sitting in the heaven on one of the planets with the earth as a footstool. When they think about the Son, that Jesus Christ peace be upon him, they think of a tall man who is fair, who has got blonde eyes, like Jeffrey Hunter, you see in the movie King of Kings. He did the acting of Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, Jeffrey Hunter. They have a certain mental picture. When they talk about Holy Ghost, they think of a dove, as the Bible says, which came upon Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, when he was baptized. Or they think it like a spirit that came at the Feast of Pentecost, which is mentioned in the Bible. But when you ask the Christian that when you speak about Trinity, how many pictures do you have in your mind, the Christian will tell you one. Believe me, he's lying to you. Because one plus one plus one is three, it is not one. Hope that answers the question.